Hey, what's up, guys?、Uh, thank you for joining us. First of all, wish you guys a very happy new year for 2018. With this video, I'm going to do a couple of updates on our Cycle Force project. I was actually quite hooked o f、uh, what our Cycle Force was actually capable of.、Uh, we tried to cram in as much as we can in terms of、um, road testing、uh, during the winter months here in Taiwan. But good weather is very、really、hard to come by at the moment.、Uh, but on one of the test runs,、uh, our cycle force actually managed to clock 112 km per hour. That's almost 70 miles an hour. We thought it was quite interesting. And I'll be showing you guys some of the parts and some of the tweaks of、uh, what we have to do in order to get to that point. So follow me, guys, and、uh, let's go! Guys. If you are ever, ever thinking about wanting to measure the top speed of your RC car, don't learn the hard way like I did. I cracked my iPhone screen as a result because I had some、uh, GPS measuring app loaded onto my iPhone. And I was silly enough to actually cable tie onto the back end of the cycle force. My cycle force actually generated enough torque that it lifted up the whole front end and did a backflip. And crack the whole upper half of the、um, iPhone screen. This is totally not worth it because you can actually get yourself a proper GPS speed measuring device, such as the one you see here, the Sky RC unit. And it fits snugly right inside the top force body shell without problem. And the shell fits back. Without issues as well. This was one of the wheel and tire our cycle force is destroying. Here's another one. I have to blame myself, but I actually crashed onto the curb and wrecked the rear wheel. Well, there are some rumors floating around on the internet that. The cameras aren't really designed for brush and setup. Well, for the TFO1 chassis, the drivetrain,、uh, I'm pleased to say that it handles pretty well、uh, with the brush and setup. But there's a weak link though、uh, the front and rear differential boards, the board differential boards, the original Hansen boards. They do not handle the torque and the abuse from the brushes setup.、Uh, luckily, we have a solution for this. We do carry and sell these silicon nitrate ceramic dirt boards.、Uh, if you check out the link in our video description, you can purchase these off our eBay account. Or if you want to purchase directly o u r f i r s t we will offer a little bit of a discount on these. And、um, they come in a pack of、uh, 16, and this will actually take care of your front and rear borders. And so far, after the upgrade, we have not come across any more problems with the worn out the boards on our、uh, cycle boards. One of the problems we are facing at the moment is the center drive shaft. If you check out our build video, we have selected to use the EA Racing、uh, hop up kit for the center drive shaft.、Uh, however, we have come across some issues with it. I will show you guys what's happening. So, low rev. Fine, right? But if I punch up the throttle, you see the center drive shaft vibrates.、Uh, I think. Quite concerning actually. If you guys have a better idea or if you know of any other 
better alternative solution. Please uh, drop, drop a comment below for us. As mentioned previously, our cycle force can produce enough torque that can lift up the front end pretty easily. To combat this, I have installed some lead weights on the front bumper and taped them up and it helps quite a bit, believe me. If you guys are thinking about doing some max speed runs as well, I would strongly recommend that you come up with some sort of uh, rollover prevention such as the wheelie bar. We had mine made up uh, very quickly with some aluminum brackets as well as the four mini four wheel drive fiberglass reinforcement plate. However, that didn't last long at all. Uh, so we have to fabricate something um, as an alternative before we head out for any more runs. Well, that's it guys. Thank you very much for your support. And if you like any more of our videos, please hit that like and subscribe button. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye.